It's all good. That's it. Absolutely. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> the blue and the white and the gray are ready. We are yes. exactly. Oh, yeah. ready. There you go. We are. We're ready. We're ready. Hey, welcome back. We are here with AK uh, from the new film Berlin at the Indian Film Festival of Los Angeles. Thank you so much for joining us. I am with Rick and Corbin. Hi, guys. How's it going? <laughs> That's fantastic. Uh, yes, we... Uh, we so I like him. I like okay. him already. I like Good night, everybody. Good night. Hey, what's up? Uh, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Uh, we Pleasure we, we have seen Berlin now, and as well as multiple of your other projects. Um, and when we loved the film, I want to talk about the film first, obviously. What, uh, what drew you as an actor to this project? Uh, so most of my films back in the day in India were majorly about uh, comedy. I, I, most of my, you know, films in the first six years of my life were only comedy mm -hmm. and nothing serious. Yes. Uh, you know, what happens is that sometimes people are not able to see you in a certain light mm -hmm. once they see you back to back doing comedy or, or any sure. particular genre. Right. So, A, I was looking for, you know, something which is absolutely different. Uh, B, this had the space where I could mellow myself down, get rid of the loud Punjabi in me, what we were talking about before we rolled the camera. <laughs> uh, and also, I mean, it's, it's, you know, the start of the film, I'm the sign language interpreter, you can see I, I'm teaching the kids, you know. So it's something which is very, very um, new to my system, new to my craft. I had never, I had picked up various dialects, various languages of different parts of the country, but not this. Mm. So I think this was something which really drew me. Uh, apart from that, I think uh, the writer and the director, Atul Sabarwal, um, he has a knack of bringing the other side of you as an actor. So I think these are the two, three things which really attracted me toward this world. The film is... We, we don't say this unless we mean it. The film is, in our opinion, absolutely fantastic. Thank you, so sweet. I did. I'll lie. Every, I'll lie. Thank you. He'll lie. <laughs> Thank you. But truly, every, every frame of film, and did, was, you just said that this was obviously a new, a new craft for you. Yeah. What was the process for you in creating this character? Did you begin with ISL, and, and how long did you take with that as well? Uh, so ISL, uh, which means Indian Sign Languages, guys. Um, so Indian Sign Language um, has really you know, uh, grown in terms of uh, the overall teaching as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, they've had new words and the way of expressing themselves. Uh, there are various schools now. People take them very seriously. The government takes them very seriously. Um, so I went to a very cool school uh, in Bombay itself, Mumbai, uh, so, so to, to, to meet, meet all these kids. And they were damn sweet. I played cricket with them, mm. had lunches with them, spent time with them to understand how the, their process. So I think that's where things became very easy. It just became a part of my system then. So yeah. I mean, as, a, as an actor, especially with a role like this that you can really sink your teeth into, what, what is your, if you have one, what is your process as an actor? Huh. I'm sure it's it, different for every role. Honestly, yeah, it's very different for everyone. Sure. I've heard stories like I use a specific perfume, like a fragrance for sure. a particular character. Right. I, I don't pull that up. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, I mean, I'm not, I mean, all due respect to whosoever's <laughs> idea is this. <laughs> not trying to slander him or her down. Sure. But having said that, uh, well, the process is simple. A, uh, read the script four times before hitting the floor. Uh, B, leave a sense of you know what happens is sometimes you get into the script so much that you're not able to listen to what the director is saying or what your co-actor is saying. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they come from a very different process and a very different background and a very different approach of how they want to tell the story or, or how they want your character to be. At the end of the day, my character is written by that person and is being directed by somebody. He has a certain knack of storytelling and that's exactly how he wants it to be. So you should leave a little scope of changing your overall sure. decibel levels to, <laughs> you know, <Yeah>. decibel <laughs> levels to, we just entered the room and the person was like, you need to lower down your decibel yes. levels. 
otherwise whenever i am talking my decibel levels are 10 on 10 right now i'm on 6 so right. you know right. uh, this so she must be the director here maybe mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you know <laughs> yes so yes. if if i would not have been uh you know prepared enough in my head and i if i wouldn't have left a scope to change that little thing about myself mm-hmm. i wouldn't have been able to do this yeah. i would have my i mean the other interviews would have been you know uh, <laughs> getting sure. getting sure. affected <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> so having said that leave a little scope of how your director wants it to be so that's my uh, process even after reading it four times apart from that uh that's how i take life as well mm. that is don't think too much mm. if you think too much it the effortless you know tinge to your character goes out mm-hmm. so i think just 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 leave a little bit of scope for imperfections as well absolutely yeah. did, did you have rehearsal time for the scenes yes of course we did we had proper workshops we had proper readings uh, the moment z studios you know had green light this film and, uh, atul made all of us sit together uh me and rahul and ishwak uh we did our readings together we did solo readings apart from that uh i think atul has a very very straight process of while reading itself it's very clear that what he wants mm. so on the set it's not really uh you know something new you have to do uh to to make sure that he's happy with your take So yeah I mean you give your take if he's not happy he asks for asks for for another one and we give another one he's okay okay with it I don't remember any take in the entire film uh which was more than twice or thrice well wow. yeah 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 that's yeah. right yeah and but the longer ones we still because I mean there were a few interrogation scenes where you know mm-hmm. we had to uh, sometimes uh, match the uh pitch the beat So yeah there were a couple of scenes where we which went on longer but most of them were very very straight and simple the interrogation scenes as you as you've mentioned or some of the highlights of the film um with you and your your co-actor Ishwak working together it must have been a dream as an actor to Absolutely. just Absolutely yeah, we're neighbors own. by the way no we're neighbors are you oh, really yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's oh, awesome me and Ishwak are neighbors that's great that's awesome so, yeah i mean uh, and he's a great guy i mean i also know uh, auntie really well She's absolutely amazing. She really blesses me as well as her own kid. So yeah, touch wood. Yeah, awesome. God has been kind. As an actor that mu- those scenes must have been really yeah, fun. Of course, yeah. See, uh, we have seen Ashwag's journey so far and back to back really good web shows he's come out of. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Absolutely. You know, especially Rocket Boys. Yep. Yeah. I think he really nailed it in Re- in Rocket Boys. So yeah, I mean, I think uh, the kind of work he's picking up uh, and he's a very very sincere actor. and a very sincere co-actor as well not not very often you get to work with people uh, who want to work together Absolutely. so i mean yeah. he's one of them who i mean who who gives your gives the co-actor the beat that okay let's let's walk hand in hand so yeah i mean and i and i and i normally you know uh, believe in that process as well so your conviction on that particular project becomes even better then Absolutely. this is a question i would ask for your writer director but in the script sound plays such an important part in the storytelling in the film absolutely was that scripted as well or was that a surprise for you to see in the final cut ani we did not know the sound at that time okay mm-hmm. the background yeah. music which came in which was much later and um, i think we all just went with uh, atul's conviction there in that case yeah. we were not really worried about you know we only knew that it will only become better with sound yeah that we knew yeah, uh, yeah. plus also if, if you talk about jubilee as well you know mm-hmm. i mean atul when he was kind of um, narrating that or when we were doing the workshops i had a little idea about that where the music is going right. so yeah i mean and and also you know uh see ours is a film which which uh, has reached uh, uh you know a very reputed film festival but it's also backed by a very very you know uh, strong production house so sure. you don't mm-hmm. you know that you know that the people they will hire will always be top notch right so i mean you know not not all the films here in film festivals are produced by big uh, production houses right. there are some humble producers as well uh, but um, uh, but in our case uh, we i think uh, overall uh were at the right place at the right time to collaborate with the right people and and you know um z studios were really really i think uh, i i love the way how, how they have you know films like um gadar 2 or kashmir files which are out and out big 
Bollywood commercial films yeah. mm-hmm. at the same time Joram or Berlin yeah. mm-hmm. or there's another Marathi film I'm forgetting the name what is the Atma name Atma huh? Atma pamphlet. Atma mm. pamphlet. Yeah. so th- I mean it's 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 beautiful to see that how a production house has uh, a vision to take all sorts of films together so I don't want to name anyone but if you pick up production houses in our country they're known for that particular palette right those colors right those 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 way that particular way of storytelling sure they don't normally try different things so i think this is this is where um, you know uh, berlin itself is a complete you know that it's backed by one of the leading production houses of the country yeah. And last question here. Yeah. Uh, I know you started your career out as, as more comedy, and now you've yeah. actually back to back Jubilee, and yeah. now this yeah. are much more dramatic. Yeah. Um, how are you liking the differences between the comedic acting and your dr- dramatic? I act? honestly, I really, really love this side of it, but I'm dying to go back to comedy. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, we yeah, got street, we got three two coming, yeah. don't we? Yeah. So we're already shooting for three two. Good. Yes. Good. The next one of uh, uh, the one I'm shooting after three two is also a comedy. We haven't announced it yet, but yeah. Because that's that's because that's the kind of energy I come from. Uh, but uh, but if you want to you know uh, get a seriousness attached to your craft, you need to do such cinema for sure. Also, I think not only acting. My 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 way of growing as an artist is I want to do everything. Though I have a you know my throat has gone for a toss today, but I have music in me. I do a lot of music. I do you know a lot of hosting. I do a lot of chat shows. There's a reason I, before starting, I asked you, you that what are your names? Because mm-hmm. so that it should look like three friends t- sitting and having a conversation. Absolutely. It should not only be you introducing me. It should also also be my audience is also there, right? Mm-hmm. Who who wouldn't maybe uh, know your names? I also want to tell them your names. So mm. this is how it is. I mean, you know. So I've been. Uh, I mean, I do a lot of chat shows. I do a lot of uh, uh, hosting, uh, live hosting in our country. So yeah, I mean, uh, I I forget <laughs> bifurcating acting into serious <laughs> and comedy yeah. I want to do all of it absolutely yeah, as you well, should well thank as you so should. much for, for sitting down and chatting yeah. with us we loved the film we loved your performance you're, you're very talented so uh, thank, thank you thank you so much so thank sweet you of you so much the for white and the blue and the grey are signing off guys <laughs> thank you so much <laughs> see Berlin. Absolutely. the music and the colors of the film are absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. fantastic